Hey guys, Gaming with Fire here, and I am here today playing a very special version of Minecraft. This version is da 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 the Aether. Game and toggle the world. And yeah, I deleted the world that I was playing on, so you won't be able to see it, but whatever. So, I am going to start a new world. I have a lot of other words, so I'm just going to name it like that. Okay, so. Option. Okay, so let's start. Dun 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 Hey guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. Uh, yeah, my Minecraft crash. As you can see, the pro tip that is part of the Aether mod, and uh, so here we go. That looks like the world I spawned in. Yeah, I had just crashed before when I was trying to load the world, so that kind of sucked. Okay, yep, it was. So I am in a swamp biome. So, I am going to be back in a couple seconds with an Aether Portal ready. Okay, so I am back and I have built an Aether Portal. Dun, da, da, dun. The cool part, so pretty much, yeah, not the cool part. Uh, the Aether Portal is built in the same fashion as another portal, but you use glowstone, and instead of activating with flint and steel, you use water. So, and that is our Aether Portal. I do have too many items installed, but I will not be using it. Only reason I had it installed was so I could build the Aether Portal without actually having to get the actual stuff. So after this episode, I'm going to switch to a raised minimap version because that is pretty useful. So here we go. Our adventure into the Aether begins now. I'm just going to let you guys know, I'm also going to be doing an Aether 2 series at exactly the same time as this one, which is going to be kind of weird, but the reason I'm doing this one is so people have background information, like, like they understand what the Aether is and stuff, if they watch the Aether 2 and they have no idea what I'm talking about. So, so as you can see, I have spawned in the Aether, and I'm getting a bit of lag, but that's because this is a pretty big mod and my computer is not that amazing, but um, anyways... Yeah, so I got lucky and I did not spawn in the middle of the air, because as you can see, you fall. For some reason I did not get a cloud parachute, but that is okay. As you can see, there are these different types of clouds. I am also playing on a Christmas version of this, because I couldn't figure out how to install the later versions. But whatever, so I'm going to quickly get some, uh, s some wood. In the Aether, it is called Skyroot. Skyroot log. And then I'm gonna quickly build a crafting table and get myself some tools. I do want to let you know that uh, in the Aether, there are four different types of tools you can get. Well, like basic tools that you can get from ores or stone and stuff like that. And, well, all of those tools have a uh, certain special property to them. Like, something that makes them different. Not just being powerful, but, but different. So, I'm just going to go ahead and explain it as I get them. So, I'm going to make some scary sticks. And there we go. I have a Skyroot pickaxe. So, Skyroot pickaxe is pretty much what they do is they will actually, like any Skyroot tools, they will drop two of whatever they're mining. So, as you can see, I mine this holy stone, and it falls out of the air. Okay, that's just bad luck. Um, let me oh, trap myself up. <coughs> Excuse me. 
Okay, so yeah, I had a bit of lag there. Um, I do need to get across there, so I'm gonna collect some dirt, and I'll show you what happens when I'm on. Yeah, I do have a cold, so don't hate on me, please. <laughs> Also, uh, feel free to let me to let me know if, if there are any better video recorders, because I don't really know many. Like I'm using QuickTime Player right now, and it's kind of bad. Anyways, so this is a very risky bridge, but I will go ahead and try it anyways, because there are these things called zephyrs that knock you lag, uh, that knock you off. Like they try to knock you off the ether. As you, that is what those are zephyrs. See, as you see, they shoot snowballs. They don't actually hurt you, but they do knock you backwards. So I'm probably going to get kicked off here and die, but... Come on. Lag. I don't know why I'm getting all these lag spikes. Okay, so I have made it. And there appears to be a floating quick soil. Oh, no, because it's over here. I am going to get some of this because you can make glass out of it. And the glass actually glows, which is pretty cool. See some ambrosium up there? So this is a golden oak tree. Golden oak tree. They can they drop golden ambers when you mine them. And yeah, I don't really know what golden ambers do. I haven't done that much research on this mod. Oh, that is a cockatrice. I do know that they shoot poison darts at you. So I'm gonna retreat over here. So as you can see, I just got two holy stone from mining one. That is the special property of the uh, Skyroot pickaxe and Skyroot tools. They drop two of whatever you have, of whatever you're mining. So, I'm actually gonna go up here. I did notice that mysterious ore over there. That ore is called a doji. It can be used to enchant grass, which pretty much just makes it fast, like makes you be able to walk faster on it. Uh, you can make torches out of it. So, it's pretty useful. And I'm gonna go around again. So I do not know why this tree is disintegrating. Anyways. Let's just get some more holy stone. I think that's enough. So let's go drop down. Let's head back to the crafting bench. Crafting team or whatever you want to call it. Charge. Uh. I do not know why I just mined that with a pickaxe. Whatever. Okay, so now I am going to craft some holy stone. So, a holy st holy stone tools have the chance. When they, whatever they're mining or digging up, they have the chance of dropping an abrosion shard. So that is the special property of holy stone, which I find pretty cool. And I need to make six first. Go ahead and make myself a sword. And I'm probably going to be leaving this area. But I need to always stay close because I have my aether portal. There are these different types of slimes that are in the aether. I don't. There's a golden one that drop that can drop either. I think glowstone blocks. That's probably what I'm gonna try to rely on to get a new aether portal. But um, yeah. But then there's a type a blue different type of slime. I don't remember what it drops, but whatever. There's, ooh, blueberries. Um, I'm gonna collect these. 
because this is a source of food, actually. But my game is really pushy, and sometimes I can't pick up blueberries, which is really annoying. And I'm getting hit. But I will pick up the stem, because if you plant them down, you could get blueberries again. Like, it'll regrow. Because that one's still the blueberry over there. So I'm actually going to go heading, looking for a dungeon. I do know that in the aether and lag spike. Okay, this is a huge lag spike. I think my game might crash. What is going on? I'm gonna restart my Minecraft. I will be back. And as I did restart my Minecraft, I did also install. Well, I did. I did use my Raise Mini Map version of the, of the Aether, so I should have the map. Yep, there we go. As you can see in the top right corner, I have the Raise Mini Map. The thing I find cool about it is how it even works in the Aether. Oh my gosh, another lag spike. Hey guys, I am back, and I actually had to restart my Minecraft twice because it was not working. Um, as you can see, I am very laggy. I need to check. Am I using a lot of memory? No, I am not. So, oh shoot, I just took a couple screenshots. Epic fit. Uh, whatever. So, I'm actually going to go look for a dungeon right now. That is another ore that I can't mine yet because I need a better tool. So I'm actually going to go looking for a special tool, and that is another thing called ice stone, which you can use in a freezer to freeze things. So I'm going to go look for that certain ore. Uh, oh, what the heck? Is this a zephyr? Oh, yep, it was. So I'm gonna go mine into this hole in hope of finding my special ore. Probably should make a couple torches because I don't want to risk mobs spawning all over me. There we go. I have found it. This special ore is called. I know. No. This ore is called. Give me a second. I'm just mining it. Huh? Okay. This ore is called Xanite Gemstone. This is the second most powerful ore in the aether. So I'm gonna go ahead and craft a Xanite pickaxe. I think that will be useful. There we go, a Xanite pickaxe. So, pretty much, this pickaxe, the this property I really like about it, it gets, it mines faster as it gets weaker. So, like, pretend that my Xanite pickaxe was as weak as this Skyrim, like, meaning, like, it was almost gonna break, like, see the bar? It would actually mine faster than it would now. So that is a pretty cool property that I like about it. And right now I'm actually going to go get that ore that I saw right here. Oh, there's also some abrosion, which I'm not going to dare go for. Um, so I'm going to build a bridge. And then I'm getting shot at. I'm probably going to fall off. And I, I fell off. Okay, I'm dead. Uh, yeah. So I just died. And as you can see, I fall out of the sky and hit my and land on my portal. So I'm just gonna quickly grab all my stuff, then I'll head back up into the aether. Oh shoot, where's my okay, I was gonna say where's my Xanite pickaxe? Well I did say that. 
Okay, you know what? Give me this though. Ow. Okay. For the bird side, I'm not hungry anymore. So let's go head back into the aether. My main concern is that if it rains, the um oh I can actually see the sun. If it rains, it will pretty much screw up my game. Not really screw up my game, because it'll turn like all dark here in the aether. And then um yeah, and then all these cockatrices will start spawning and then they're really annoying because they shoot poison darts. But I will have to get over it and play my game. That's one death. Let's see if I can finally pick you up. Nope. And I just got shot. So I'm gonna move out. I like slow motion ninja dodge. I don't know why I said that, but uh, oh, see, there is a cockatrice over there. I'm probably gonna have to try to kill it. So I'm just gonna sprint across my bridge and attack it. Yep, I'm poison. Okay, this is called this is cockatrice poison. Um, I'm gonna dig myself a hole so I don't fall because it makes you move all crazily. See, I can't control myself. I'm not even touching my mouse or anything. So I'm just gonna wait till this goes away. It should go away. I see some more Zenit up there. Right there. How long is this poison gonna last? I got shot like two times. Come on. Meantime I am going to get my Zenite pickaxe. And wait till this goes away. This is doing a lot of damage. I'm probably gonna die from it. Okay, there we go. Get some more blueberries. It's because they're just awesome. And I can't grab you. Um, so I actually need to figure out where that was. So I'm gonna make like a little mine here, sort of, in hopes of getting that gravel. I'm not gonna say the name. <laughs> oh, I'm not gonna say my lap block because if I fall through. And there we go. So, this ore is called, as you can see it floated up, Gravitite. And it defies gravity. Ouch. Oh. So, I have five Gravitite, so that is good. I need to make an enchanter, which is a special sort of a thing. Yeah, I'm right now I'm just concentrating on not getting knocked off. Get lag spikes, of course. I'm not using that much memory. This is kind of weird. Oh, shoot. Oh, that was that just perfect timing. Um, I'm going to mine this with Skyro because it gives me two. So I'm just going to mine this Ambrosium. Yeah, and those are really the only ores in the Aether. There's no, there are no other ores, sadly.
Sorry about that background noise. Oh, come on. Okay, perfect. Oh, how that? Perfect. 27 erosion. So, oh, and there's more. Oh, shoot. Oh, God. If I died there. Yep, that's exactly what I was expecting, so I'm gonna actually take my way. Yeah, yes. Okay. I'm under heavy fire. Okay, that was. Okay, so now get out of here. No lag spike. Just because I'm lucky. Yep, I could tell that was going to happen. Um, I'm actually going to go over here. Okay, so I'm gonna get some of these. These are called these special blocks are called cold arrow clouds. And they are useful and I will show you why. See some then and over there. Nah, I'm not gonna go for it. So I am going to break you and you because as you can see I sunk down into it. Like that. So you can't actually jump out. And I think I am out. Yep. So I'm actually going to settle down and probably make a house. So. Soil. Blueberry. Oh, yeah, also good soil. It can. See, as, as you can see, it pushes me off. Whichever direction I go, I, it's like worse than ice. You slide and it pushes you. So. Actually, probably gonna make a little house in that area right there. First, I must get this abrosion. There is one thing I want to do before I end off this video. And I am just trying to hurry up and make a little house so I can do it. So I'm just gonna, before I mind that, I don't mind that next episode. I'm just going to quickly wax bike. Uh, I'm just going to quickly make a little sort of house. There we go, and I'll place the third there. I will get a torch. 
place a chest. Well, I'll make one. Uh, shoot, I need more wood. Whatever. For now, I will end the episode with this. That is an altar. Mm, that doesn't work. Uh, yeah, that's what I meant. That's what I actually need an altar. And I will end this video off right here after you see this. It is working. It's called an altar, but it says enchanter. <laughs> That's funny. Almost there. You know I'm gonna put all of this. See, this is gravitite ore. First of all, I'll show you guys one more thing. Quickly before the episode, if this would hurry up. Ta da! Enchanted gravitite. So you can make tools out of this. So I'm gonna end up episode here. And well, remember to like and subscribe, and thanks for watching. Peace out.